COVID-19 is a global crisis affecting the world. Its effects on communities have necessitated institutions and stakeholders to join forces in combating the spread of the virus. The latest to come to the aid of beneficiaries is Turkey's International Cooperation Agency, who presented food items to Birkama Area Council for onward distribution to 250 families. And uh, I hope this contribution of TICA uh, will bring relief to the families in need. And uh, also, uh, this contribution is also meaningful because it is uh, happening in the holy month of Ramadan. And uh, this brings us together uh, closer. And on this occasion, uh, I express my sincere thanks to Tika for extending its helping hand to uh, our Gambian uh, brothers and sisters. And on, the, on this opportunity, I would like to uh, thank governorship and municipality for providing us such uh, an important uh, opportunity. And as Turkey, we will continue to be with our Gambian uh, brothers and sisters uh, to ease the pains and difficulties of this uh, pandemic. The chairman of Birkama Area Council commended the donors for the intervention. This is a wonderful gift that we really appreciate more. And it cannot have come to uh, at a better time than now when people are living in fear of coronavirus, COVID-19, and uh, most of the people who, uh, who are living within the West Coast region are observing the Ramadan. The governor of West Coast region also welcomed the Dika's move. Today's ceremony is very specific. It's in the sense that the Turkish ambassador and team are donating some food items and sanitary materials to the very needy people in the region. Turkey and the Gambia have very strong relationship as far back more than 15 years ago. And they were intervening in various sectors of country's development, especially within the security sector. Today you can see that they are demonstrating that sort of bilateral cooperation existing between them and the people of the Gambia through the councils. With the Gambia registering a number of confirmed cases of COVID-19, officials took time to call on the public to adhere to government and World Health Organization recommended measures. Sergio. Yeah,